Okay, I'm finally out uh, checking some traps this fall. Uh, this will be my first day of really checking any amount of traps. Me and Dad just set uh, a bunch of them oh, a week ago, close to a week ago. Uh, I checked once, but it was only after a night because I was heading up to my camp. So, anyways, this is my uh, first real check day, and I'm also going to uh, just throw in a bunch of videos from uh, earlier in the fall when I was trapping kind of on and off. I just took a bunch of clips, so I'll just throw them together to be a bunch of different days, but I'll just throw them together and uh, show you what I caught. Anyways, I'm just checking my first trap here, and uh, here I was thinking I caught something albino. I was kind of pumped, but I'll show you what I caught. It's friggin' the waters went up a foot here, so <laughs> see you can see it. I can see it from a distance. I'm pretty sure it's a northern pike. I've never caught one in this spot before, but it's there's a lake just out here, so I guess it's from up the creek. Anyways, I'm gonna have to get him out of the trap and reset. And uh, I caught a muskrat just over there in a 3.30, I'll show you that. I'm gonna get them out too. <clears throat> Anyways, I'll uh, show you, get these out of the traps and uh, show you what I got. Okay, so here's the remake of my one set. I don't know if you can really see that. I got this little, uh, just overflow from a lake. And it flows into another lake here. Anyways, this is a good spot for a beaver. And I originally set this right here, this is all dry. So the water's come up about 8 or 10 inches. And I actually caught a mink in it, not a muskrat. So. And there's a the pike. So I'm minking a pike here at this spot. So The pike doesn't look overly good to keep, so I'm going to uh, throw him out for the otters. And the mink, I guess. So, Anyways, uh, I'm going to carry on. That was my first two traps. So got another 25 or so to check. So. Hopefully we get some more. See you in a bit. Okay, I forgot to show you. I had, uh, I just got some, uh, dive sets in this little creek here. Rolled right there. And I caught a, one beaver and a muskrat. So, doing pretty good this morning. That's, uh, traps number three and four. And I got a mink, muskrat, and a beaver. So, that's sweet. Hey, right, so carry on and, uh, see what else I catch. Okay, I'm at another spot here, and I uh, got a muskrat. I don't know how well you can see that down in there, but just a little set here in this creek. It uh, flows into another lake, so that's cool. Catch a lot of muskrats. I catch a lot of them normally. Seems to get more and more every year. So, anyways, it's a nice day. Just got our first snowfall, so it's fighting through some snow, but it's not too bad. Okay, we'll see you at the next check. Okay, just that uh, another set here I got. There's a bunch of houses out in this old marsh. You can really see in that the snow's on. I didn't know uh, that one was right there. I don't know if it's uh, old or new, but there's another big one just past it, so. Anyways, and they've been damming this up on the guy. He wanted me to get rid of the beavers, so I set this little channel and uh, picked up a beaver there under the ice. More slush than ice. But I got this old house here too. Pretty sure there's a mink or something living in it. You can see where they popped up through the ice right there. So and it looks like it came out right there. It went through the grass right there. So. Anyways, I'll get this out, reset, and uh, I'll show you what I got. Okay, here's this beaver. Just uh, probably a large medium. Whew, out of breath, I just carry him freaking 100 yards. Anyways, um, yeah, I set two more traps here. I gotta clean these beaver out too, so I'm only gonna check a couple more times, so the more I traps I get in, the better chances I have of getting them. Okay, starting to snow here, and uh, I'm gonna head it down to the next uh, traps and hopefully catch something there. Okay, guys, at the next set here, I got a something. I think it's a beaver. Try to do this with one hand. Oh my! Beaver, yeah. Nice. Looks like a big one. Decent size one, anyways. You can catch on them, so cool.
yeah, I'll get him, uh, him out of the trap here and clean this up and make her you make here. And it's got two more traps, and then uh, I'm gonna make like a baby and head out. So, okay, we'll see. Uh, hopefully, I have the next trap, so have a catch. See you bet. Okay, just uh, finished checking my last trap. Didn't catch nothing here. So I finished the day with four or five beavers, uh, mink, two muskrat. So that's an alright check day for me. More than uh, enough work to keep me busy. So, anyways, till next time. Thanks for watching, guys. Take care. Okay, just checking my first trap of the year. I got a little fox. This is set for coyote. It's right on the edge of a gravel pit here. This is where I get gravel from. And uh, the coyotes. It's right on the edge of this field. <laughs> and the coyotes have been uh, they going in the gravel pit for whatever reason. And I got this fox. So I'm going to take care of him and keep on checking. See if I caught something today. Other than this. Okay, so this is what my set looks like when it was uh, remade after I caught that fox. So hopefully a uh, coyote or a wolf comes by now. That's what I'd rather catch, but beggars can't be choosers, I guess. So, anyways, I'll carry on and check a few more traps. Uh, see what else I get today. <laughs>